So fall is here, which means fall fashion, which is a lot of people's favorite styling season. So today I'm gonna look at some of the good and some of the bad trends that I've seen online so far. We'll start with the bad and then end the video on a good note. And also I just wanna say, these are all my personal opinions. So if you don't like some, let me know in the comments below. The first one is a roll neck. The roll neck is not a turtleneck, nor is it like a crew neck. It's like a combination of both. And for me personally, it kinda doesn't fit my style. The way I dress, I'm more casual. And with this one, it's, I don't know. For me, I just feel like I'll have a hard time styling it or it just have like an awkward look to it. Whenever I see pictures of people with the roll neck, it looks unique, but it just looks different. Maybe it's gonna take some time on me and things like that, but I just don't like the outward look of it. I just feel like I really like turtlenecks. Turtlenecks, they're perfect, but the roll neck, it just feels a little, like not done. I do like the rolled up ends, like the um, the sleeves, it rolls up. And then also at the bottoms, they roll up. I really like that. But the neck, I've seen some that are wider than others. So for some reason, it always reminds me of uh, like that U-neck t-shirt. It's just very wide and kind of out of place. But personally, this is not my style, but I have seen some pictures online that some people do look nice with it, but it still looks a little bit awkward. So I don't know for me, maybe I'm wrong or maybe it just haven't dawned on me personally. This is not for me. One of the things that I'm actually liking and I'm actually thinking about getting a pair is the mock toe shoes. It's like mock toe boots or mock toe upper and then the bottom of shoes. I've seen the Doc Martin ones and I really like them. I'm not going to get the leather ones because I don't want to deal with any breaking in period or anything like that. The suede ones look very nice. And for me, I've seen other brands do the same thing. And these ones, honestly, they fit my style. I feel like they're very nice. They're very seamless and they don't do too much. They remind me of like the Clark Willoughby's, but with a more, I guess, stronger or firmer um, sole. So with these ones, definitely like them. And also they remind me of um, the Timberland uh, boat shoes, you know, they can be like distant cousins. But honestly, these ones, I feel like they fit my style. I feel like the way that I've seen them online. They're very casual, they're very nice. And uh, they just give like that unique taste to it. Definitely like the mock toe shoes. The next thing that I don't like and I've read about is like, people are saying that denim on denim might be back. And for me, honestly, I'm not with the denim on denim or what is it, the Canadian tuxedo. I just feel like denim on denim, for me, for some reason, it just feels like very stiff. It feels very uncomfortable. I do know like there's some nice, comfortable denim, but denim on denim, I don't know. It's not, it's not my style. And uh, I just feel like it's overkill, but I do like denim on denim when it's not matching denim, if you understand what I mean. Like black jeans with like uh, regular denims blue denim or dark blue denim. I do feel like if you mix and match, they can come together properly. But whenever people do think about denim on denim, it's mainly everything blue, you know, the blue jeans, blue tie, blue, everything, you know. I've heard of the Canadian tuxedo and then also I've heard of the Texas tuxedo. So those, they seem very interesting, but they're not up my style. Honestly, they're cool. I know that some people might like them, but me personally, I'm not with it. I just feel like denim on denim is overkill and I don't know, I still think that they're stiff. The next trend that I've actually like is the grandpa style, like the epileptic, electric, uh, but the grandpa style and um, that one, I definitely like it. I just see like a lot of people, especially the younger folks, they're getting more into dressing a bit older into like things that stylish grandpas will wear. And honestly, I can definitely see myself in this category because I do feel like I do dress a little bit older. My, my style is, I don't want to say timeless, but it's more on that older, you know, style. And honestly, I like it. I feel like I can definitely fit in. I feel like I have no issues with this. I already have some pieces in my closet that just fits the style. And then also with now the trends that people are wearing more loafers and uh, things like that, cardigans, sweaters, Mm, it's just gonna be very easy. And I do like this style. I do like when people like dress up or not streetwear all the time. So this one definitely is one of my favorites. And then also I do like uh, that fisherman style, even though there is no water anywhere next to me. So all of that 
incorporates into it and uh yeah i can definitely see myself rocking this and uh having a good time with it another trend that i really haven't been liking is the super oversized of things i don't mind oversized things but when it fits it looks perfect but once it's like super super oversized and like things are dragging especially your pants which is like my biggest no-no especially whenever you go outside imagine you go outside everything is dragging you collect all that dirt and basically bring it home and no me personally i don't like it especially the oversized pants i don't mind oversized shirt oversized jacket i do feel like that's a style but whenever like the pants are so oversized that you're basically a part-time street sweeper and yeah for me personally that's my only thing with the oversized thing but if you get it oversized and you get it fitted or you get it tailored to a point where it's not dragging everywhere then you look perfect and then on the flip side when people do wear like super tight tight like you know you're if you fart you're basically gonna see a gas bubble or if they sneeze they're like one sneeze away from being butt naked so yeah those things are not trends for me that i'll be doing i do like to you know whenever i'm in shape i do like to wear like a fitted shirt but not when it's so fitted that it looks painted on so that's what i really don't like and I, hopefully the trend slowly dies out but i do see some people that do like super baggy super tight the last style trend that i've actually like is just fall like the fall vibes you know i definitely like fall i just like the bright colors the different colors the layering of jackets vest and just like that endless possibility of fall because sometimes for me summertime i just want to be comfortable i don't want to be hot so trying to layer things it can be a little bit difficult and then i don't want to wear things that have like a lot of holes in it or like fishnet stuff so yes i definitely enjoy the fall and uh what fall like i said endless possibilities this year i plan on experimenting a lot with my outfits you know so mainly just like taking a pair of jeans and seeing how many different ways i can style them let me cuff them let me do different things with them and seeing how i can do that or for example where i can take like my chelsea boots and try to style it a different way that i'm used to because usually whenever people do wear chelsea boots they kind of get stuck in after just styling it like casual you know but i do want to take just a little bit of a leap and just try different things and i definitely enjoy fall because i feel like it's the perfect time you know you can layer different things you can try different things and uh right now there's a bunch of resources to help you and there's a bunch of different styles that's going around so i am definitely excited about that and just thinking about it it gets me super excited so yeah so far those are the fall trends that i've seen and some that i've disliked some that i like let me know if i missed any and uh thank you so much for watching and if you like videos like this please let me know down in the comments below peace out